Ooh. Ooh. That feels like a good one. Yep, here. <laughs> he ate it. Ooh, that's another good one. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. <gasps> oh, gosh, that is. Oh, it's probably in it. Yeah. It's probably yeah. In it. Holy cow. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Cole and Jay and today we have brought our brand new boat out here to Woo! one of our favorite spots in the back of this creek. And today we are targeting nothing but slab crappie. <laughs> this is a spot where we've caught a lot of big ones in the past and we're hoping to do so again today. This is actually our first trip back here this year and uh, we're looking forward to it. We're seeing a lot of bait fish in the back of the creek already, which is a very good sign. Um, it's pretty cool out, which is good. The fish usually bite better back here when it's kind of cold. Mm -hmm. And um, we're just excited. We're excited to be out in our boat and not in our kayaks. And we're both very hopeful that we will be able to sling some slabs into this boat. So guys, if y'all are excited to join along with us on this maiden crappie voyage, do us a huge <laughs> favor, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of our future fishing adventures. But with that being said, We've got some slabs to catch. You ready to go? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's go. Down. Got one. That didn't take long. Oh, it is. Look at that. <laughs> that was your first cast. Wow. What's wrong with you, you savage? <laughs> in my element. She's in her element. First cast <laughs> out here, and she's got a keeper, I think. We'll measure her to make sure, but that's going to be pretty close. Heck yeah. Look at her eight chartreuse. Yeah, he did. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's get them measured really quick. Oh, yeah. That's easy. That's 11 inches. All right. Woohoo! Oh, don't fall out of here. <laughs> Oh my goodness. We gotta get used to using these live wheels. <laughs> oh yeah, we have a live one. Hey. Hey, nice. First cast. Hopefully, um, that's not a bad sign. Hopefully not. not. my first cast. There's a little fish. Little fish. <laughs> Dang. That was my second cast, but definitely not the same result that Jay had on her first one. Tiny little guy, but he's cute though. And he bit my chartreuse tube too, so maybe that is going to be a big piece of this puzzle today. Oh, big one? No. Little guy. Phew, I was worried about catching a fish on my first cast that I might not catch another one, but thankfully that's not the case today. But this one is a lot smaller, definitely not a keeper, and he is so cold. Oh my goodness. Whew. Okay. See ya. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Gotta be. He hit it so hard. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Up here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Boom. Now that right there is the fish that we came here to catch today. A big old white crappie. Just a, look at me, look at the slabs on that guy. Yeah, that is Super awesome. studly. He's gonna be probably like a pound, pound and a quarter or so. There's fish up here that can get up to two pounds and I've heard of three pounders coming out of the spot. So I'm excited about this. We haven't been out here very long at all and we're already catching them. So that's a really good thing. So we're gonna get back to casting, see if we can catch some even bigger than this guy. So sick. <laughs> well, there we go. Feels like a good one. Woo! Am I a key? Yeah, it might be. It'd be close. Yeah, it is going to be really close. Eight and a half. Let's get a measure on it. You what? Eight and a half inches. Eight and a half? I'm thinking nine and three quarters. <laughs> Actually, it's going to be, I bet it's ten. Ten incher. Oh my gosh, right at ten. Ten incher. Heck yeah. Third keeper. Third keeper. <laughs> Add him to the box. Yeah. Oh, fish on. Fish on. Woohoo. She's an animal. 
Is that gonna keep? It's gonna be another close one. This one might be a little short. I'm I think he's sure. short. He's short. Yeah. He's short. He's like nine. Dang, are you catching them all at chartreuse? Yeah. Dang. Oh. <laughs> nice. This is fun. I know. It's like I'm like not even really paying attention. I'm just like I'm just nonchalantly casting out here. <laughs> not even. I don't have a care in the world. I'm just fishing. <laughs> There's a good one. Oh, he came off. Oh man. Man, what was that? What was that? There we go. There's another one, but oh, he's going to be too little. But dang, they're still thumping it. And that's what's really fun <laughs> is feeling the thump. It gets you all excited. There we go. Another crappie still searching for a slab. I want to catch a slab like cold caught. There we go. Dang. Such a big thump for a little fish. Oh my goodness. What the heck? I thought for sure that was going to be a slab. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of going the other direction in size. We need to be going up. Definitely going down. Ooh. Ooh. That feels like a good one. Oh gosh, Jay. <laughs> yeah, this is the fish I came out here for. Oh my gosh, look at this slab. He's a slabby slab. About the same size as the first one, the first big slab we got. Might be bigger, I don't know, but that is a really nice one. Whew. And he had a chartreuse too, didn't he? No. Oh yeah, 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 he did. He also yeah. he's also hooked right here too. Oh, hooked in the button. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he did he did eat the chartreuse. That's a beautiful white crappie. <laughs> So stoked. It was getting quiet in the back of the boat. I was like, man, Jace, Jace do for one. Yeah, it's been a minute, but hey, I am happy with this guy. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh god. That's nice something? Or is that a snag a big old crappie? Oh. Hang on now. It's a crappie. Hang on now. He ate it. Oh, that's another good one. Swing him in the boat. Woo! <laughs> Man, it sure is nice to have a slab queen on your team. That's all I gotta <laughs> say. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much fun. He's not as big as the last one I just caught, but that's a good one. That's a really good one. I mean, <laughs> if we caught, if we catch those all day, I am happy. Oh yeah. I mean, beautiful white crappie, smash that chartreuse tube. You thought yeah. you had him snag. He was fighting all weird, but yeah. he had a thing choked. They are loving the chartreuse. I know. Normally we catch them on like bait fish colors out here, but since the water's kind of stained, that chartreuse is standing out in the water a little bit better and they're smashing it. It's so much fun. Oh my goodness. I think it's our fifth one in there. You put four of them in there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just letting you do your thing. I'm just up here messing around. <laughs> here we go. Whoop, whoop. Put them in there. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> Golly, I got so pumped. Another one here on the middle grub. Not a monster, a little eight incher. Smashed it though. Thought I missed it. I thought it was a three pounder, four pounder. State record. It's crazy how vicious those little crappie can be. That might be a decent one. Might be decent. It's decent, but not a keeper. Okay. The bite has really slowed down for us. We're getting bit like once every like 10 minutes, it feels like, which isn't that bad, honestly. But uh, we started off, we were getting bit like almost every cast. Just a little guy. He'll be a keeper next year, though. And we'll come back for him. Look at those turtles. Chilling, they're hugging. That's a big turtle. Oh, a next cast. It's a little black crappie. Oh, sorry, buddy. 
Pretty sure it's our first black crappie of the day. Wish he was five times larger though. Ooh, that's a little one. Goodness, they can make you think for a second that you got a big one. The way they bite it, oh my goodness. But he is way too small. <laughs> See ya. not a keeper but I finally got another bite it's been a hot minute maybe a hot oh what an hour yeah feels like an hour without a bite but unfortunately this one we're gonna have to throw back see ya Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. That is a big one. Be a crappie. Oh, it's a giant crappie, JJ. Oh, it's a big crappie. Oh, it's a big crappie. Stay on there. Stay on there. This is what we need right here, Jay. This is the fish we were fishing for all day long. Oh my gosh. He hit it so hard. <gasps> oh gosh, that is huge. Oh, that's a crappie in it. That's a crappie. Yeah. Holy cow. Oh. I got it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Yes. Finally, guys. That is definitely the biggest of the day. It has been a grind. By far. We caught a lot of fish when we first got here. And then we fished for like two hours with like nothing. And this is a really, really nice one. I'm sorry, Jay, but that is definitely the biggest one of the day. That thing is huge. I mean, he's not going to be a two pounder. He's going to be like a pound and three quarters it is just such a heavy sided fish he hit that jig so hard and it really just kind of hit me as a shock i was like wow that was a nice bite <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> and a great fight i mean just a really really quality quality fish and i think this is going to be the last fish that we catch out here today we've been just grinding it out here for the last couple of hours without really catching much we've caught a few little ones here and there but the slabs really disappeared for a while and uh, we are just about out of time. So I think we'll put this one in the box and we are going to head on back to the house. But dang, <laughs> what a fish. That <laughs> is a slab. Slab oh my like gosh. <laughs> Realize we had our scale. So let's get a weight on this guy real quick. Yep, just as I figured, one pound and 11 ounces. Just a really, really solid fish. Doesn't get any better than that, unless they're two pounds. <laughs> okay, we're gonna throw this one in the box. I'll probably make like one or two more casts in that area just to make sure it's not a school when fired up, but um, this is probably our last fish. So let's get him in the box and let's get out of here. Okay guys, we find ourselves here once again, back at the cleaning table. I've got some of our fish that we caught today in the creek here on the table. I'm about to clean them up real quick and we're gonna take them inside and cook them up for supper. So I'm gonna look at a couple of these white crappie. Look at this one right here, that's the biggest one we got today. Just a big old beautiful slab. It's gonna have some really, really nice meat on it. Here's a couple of the other ones we have here. Really, really nice fish. Shouldn't take too long to clean. We do this all the time, you know? So let's whip through these guys real quickly and then let's get them sizzling in the skillet. All right, just finished cleaning up the fish and we were actually in the kitchen now and I've already got the fillets on the skillet cooking along with a bowl of rice. Let me turn this camera around show you guys how we got these fish seasoned up and how we're gonna be cooking them tonight. It's really simple, really easy, one of our favorite ways to do it. We just have the crappie fillets here in the skillet and some butter and we have them seasoned up with some of this stuff right here, some little black and redfish magic. That stuff is really tasty and um, I'll only have them seasoned on that top side. The underside is not seasoned just so it's not overkill. And then right here, we just have a pot of brown rice, which I actually think, let me see, is that done? That is actually done. Take that off. Oh, shoot. Don't do that. But anyways, those should be done only in a few minutes or so, and then we'll put the two together, and it should be very, very tasty. It's really simple and delicious, and um, I'm ready to eat because I'm very hungry, so we'll catch you whenever it's all done.
Okay, Jay, how are you feeling about that? This looks so dang good. Thank you so much for cooking it and making my plate for me. <laughs> I'm really excited to try it. Honestly, it wasn't hard. I, I mean, that that's like minute rice and just fish in the <laughs> skillet. It's like the most quick and dirty way you can cook fish on earth, but it should be tasty. It always is. It always is. <laughs> but let's make sure. And while you're chewing that, I think honestly, mm. the, I think honestly, what's gonna help us with this is that that fish is like ultra fresh. Mm -hmm. The last few times we've had fish, we kind of let them sit in the fridge for a day or two, but this is like straight out the water and straight on the plate. It's straight up good. Oh my goodness, this is delicious, Cole. It's that black and red fish magic. I wish I could take credit for it, really, mm. but I think the only thing we can take credit for is you know securing the fish. Mm -hmm. But the seasonings, that's uh, that's the what's his name, Chef Prudhomme. That's his stuff. <laughs> Okay, I've come to join you, Jay. I've got a little bit here on the fork. Simple, yet very, very effective. Oh yeah. It's super good, and it's healthy. Mm -hmm. I, think we didn't, I think if we had like less seasoning, it'd probably be better, but I, th I don't think a seasoning really makes it bad for you. Mm -mm. It just makes it really good. <laughs> Definitely recommend it if you're looking for you know, a really quick and simple recipe just to whip up really quickly if you are a really busy person like us and don't have a lot of time to cook. This is the way to do it. Oh yeah. And it makes you feel good. And you don't have that same sort of crash that you might would get if you like ran through this McDonald's drive-thru or something like that. Yeah. And honestly, it's about as fast to like put this together. I know it's a little bit faster to go through the drive-thru, but this is definitely I don't know, worth this could it. be faster. I guess if you already have your fish <laughs> cleaned and prepped, for sure. It really could be. You're Just right about that. It depends on the day at McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely way better than McDonald's. All right, well, we're gonna finish our dinner. Thank you guys so much for going crappie fishing with us today. It was so much fun getting out there in our new boat and putting some slack labs in it. Man, that's awesome. It was really <laughs> awesome. I'm glad we were able to put some in the boat and maybe next time we can go out there and stay a little longer and catch yeah. some even bigger ones and possibly more. But I, yeah, like she said, I think this is where we're going to end today's episode. We hope y'all enjoyed it. If so, do us a huge favor. Hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our future fishing adventures. We're, we're Colin J and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye guys. Woo.